language. And he wrote in simple Bengali language, language of course, for us who are not understanding. If somebody is from Bengal today, you know, from us who are not understanding Bengali, it will not make any difference. But uh, it's mentioned that they wrote songs in a simple, simple Bengali language because so that everybody could understand. But the conclusion was really high of those. And uh, those songs, they are songs, songs in the villages all over the Bengal or wherever uh, Vaishnavas are staying. So, uh, Lochandas Thakur, he was born in the, in the, uh, just after Chaitanya Mahaprabhu left. He was almost contemporary of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So he and he has he was a disciple of Sri, Sri Narahari Sakar Thakur and he was he met Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Nityananda Prabhu. And like I, I, I told already, he wrote a book called Chaitanya Mandala. And uh, there are few uh, biographies of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So everybody knows who is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu standing on the altar. Yeah. Everybody nobody is somebody who doesn't know? Everybody knows. Yeah. So uh, there are few books telling stories from the life of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and of course Chaitanya Charitamrita Srila Prabhupada translated that book and it is uh, most important and kind of official biography of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu accepted among all Vaishnavas. But there are also some other books and one of those books is Chaitanya Mangala and Lochanda Astaku he wrote a book and it's interesting, uh, in that book, uh, you can find some pastimes of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu you cannot, you cannot find in the other Chaitanya Charitamrita or Chaitanya Bhagavat. These two are like the most famous. They teach with their example, not only that, but they give very easy way. So in the Kali Yuga it is said that uh, demigods, 30, 30 million demigods, they are eager to take birth now on earth, they stay in the queue. There is queue, demigods queue. They wait. They want to come here to take birth. Nobody normally is speaking Kali Yuga, everybody wants to fly away. Of course we not because we think we have we think we have good here, most of us. But those who from higher planets, they don't they Kali Yuga is really bad. But now because Karan and Tagora Chanda, they came to Amsterdam. So many demigods, they want to take birth in Amsterdam and to come here to serve Karan and Tagora Chanda and to chant their glories and Krishna's glory. Because they know, if we do that, we will be in Ananda. This, this process of uh, Hare Krishna movement, who they give, it is uh, very blissful. Even if you are on the heavenly planet, you will not get so much bliss, like now in Kali Yuga, if you follow uh, Nita Gora Chandra's process.